Hello and welcome back, my little friends. Let's do this. Let's become communist. Uh, it's oh, it's, it's this this month. Damn it. Ah, well, let's try anyway. Uh, rather to form the revolution. Oh, yeah. Or gain base national unity minus five. That's not good. Let's do it for this. Ah, here we go. They will not win the elections, though. Next election, September 40. Well, we can't wait that long. Sorry, guys. And 10 days, 8 days for the researchers. We still need a lot of stuff. Artillery at least is filled. He got the support weapons and the construction stuff. Great. What else do I need here? I would like to have all of these. All of the things. Uh, at some point we need marines. We might as well. And the next one will be artillery. Would be really good, but it's like a year. Anti-tank and anti-air would be nice to have. Uh, all of this stuff is pretty useful as well. But we have the recon and the engineering stuff. Uh, naval stuff I will not, not even try. Um, here we got the research stuff. Or this. We get a bonus for that soon. So let's go for the mechanical computing stuff. And the armament effort, here we go. And another slot. This has two more factories, which is nice. But we build them faster if we get this. Let's go for the construction effort. I guess we'll just skip elections, who cares. Uh, soon we can have another dude. Dude, the national unity is great. Uh, what if a government? Yes. Industrial concern is research time. Be quite useful. A theorist, military theorists, army. Mm. Let's get him. It gets us more um, points. It doubles the bonus by the. Uh, the gain from the training. What I mean is, we get more from this guy than from training. Which is awesome. And we need some points to add more artillery. Of course, they're taking attrition now, this little um, skull here. And oh, it's fine. Under the construction. Oh. This is interesting. Soldiers desert to communist partisans, capitalists, and nationalists. What if you spill your blood for them on the front lines during <laughs> That's exactly what I want as a communist, but I Psh, don't tell them. And brother against brother of a dispute that do not concern the working man and said blah 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 flavor text. You can pause and read this if you want to. And this is our decision. Extension public communist fifteen percent, against national spirit communist partisans recruiting. Okay, daily communist support. Awesome. Oh, Jesus Christ. That escalated quickly. We should have had that for the election, but... Well... Great. It's all in all going well. Yeah, the manpower is out. I guess we stopped training now. Oops, it's actually in here. <laughs> and here we go with the organization. And now the entrenching as well. None manpower. I guess it will be the next thing we get. 
And here we are soon done. Uh, when? Tell me. Oh. If the war in Ethiopia is over. Uh, construct faster, please. We need the shits. Class conflicts divide Sweden. No! Ah, uh, game based national unity minus 2%. That's actually okay. We are not divided. <laughs> it's basically all communist. That's our doctrine stuff. Mm, this is 200 something days. Organization plus 10% though. Artillery takes too long. Don't need tanks. We are researching this already. We could go for this. 300 days though. It's 180 only. Construction speed 10%. Actually, the best bet. Let's go for concentrated industry. And then the rest. That's our national focus done. Let's go for the next one. Or we could go for the doctrine. <coughs> Army experience plus five is a flat bonus. It adds just five. Hmm. Yeah, I want the research slot. Like, honestly, right yesterday would be preferable. It goes up so quickly, Jesus. We could edit this one now. Uh, but I can't remove this. Actually, I can. Ha! It's the same amount of dudes, and we just get Atrolu in here. Uh, that means we need a lot more artillery. But that's fine. Uh, we need more of this. Need more factories, guys. We need to pump out for the revolution. A coup. Reign of terror. Okay. Um... Paul Kemet, please somebody translate this. Jesus Christ, what just happened? <laughs> oh, who is this? It's Sven. Reign of Terror, I'm sorry about that, guys, but we had to do this. No elections, there can't be no elections. Okay, great. Um, this will be, I think this will be part of my... Um, I make a screenshot from this part of the <coughs> thumbnail. That's great. And can I now uh, fabricate claims on these clowns? Rest of fire war goal. Ostlandet. It takes a lot of political power, but we do it. It's 200 days, we have to start it early. I need more troops. Uh, yeah, we need a lot more, a lot more equipment for these guys. And the Norwegians are like, what the fuck? What are you doing? <coughs> I, I'm planning an attack. Let's make an aggression pact with the Soviets. Sven Lindroth abandons neutral foreign policy. After he is in power, that for Kermit, please don't translate this for me. Would no longer keep its neutral foreign policy. The world has become tangled and complex. I will actually write this word down and let it translate after this episode. Because otherwise I will forget. Ahem. Uh, Met. For the future of said country. Indeed. 
Good. Uh, the information says he has six to uh, eight to six, seven to thirteen. Okay, just need better information. But we have more factories. Uh, like a lot more. We outproduce his clowns. It's fine. We got this. We got uh, just I did this one again for more artillery. Uh, there's nothing to add here. Like, like, pound this clowns, huh? Yeah, let's do it. Ah, uh, this will be anti-air at some point. Anyway. British Parliament debates intervention in Scandinavia. What? Considering the strategic value of Scandinavian region to British defense f efforts and the potential risk of seeing an enemy built influence that the British Parliament has debated the possibility of military intervention. Why is the political implication of such action weighted heavily on Neville Chamberlain? Several decisive arguments have been... Oh, shit. With the threaten British independence too. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> End trade with Germany. Great Britain has an ultimatum. Either we stop our trade with Germany or they will invade. Uh, I never liked Germans anyway. <laughs> I am one. For crying out loud. Mm. Oh. Uh, I want to... I will join your faction, thank you. Sorry, when, if you don't want to be friends with me, I will be friends with the Soviets. Oh, fuck you. Here we go. We stand together. Great. I'm a bit afraid now. Um, we don't even need this, right? There's a lot of political power to gain here. And a lot of political power again. And a lot of research bonuses. Cat, come down. And this will give us what? Hmm. No. Infrastructure first. I would like to be the leader of this faction, but I... <clears throat> it's unrealistic, I guess. Need a lot more artillery, but that's fine. We are good with infantry equipment. Uh, we use that soon. Uh, modify government again. Political... Uh, we don't need these. Oh. Construction speed was this here. Electronics research time, it's kind of useful. What is in here? Artillery attack and defense. Infantry division attack. Mm -hmm -hmm. It's just a tank designer dude. And this is all the artillery stuff, small arms. Uh, but I want to have uh, disarm sure uh, we need more people and there goes our manpower let's get these two guys no what here these two Yeah, I never liked the f these fucking Brits. Seriously? <laughs> you assholes. You people are dicks. I will possibly just lose this game. Great. Thanks, Great Britain. Uh, 
You have to get more troops on the ground, like ASAP. If not enough artillery in production. Uh, yeah, he's angered. Give me that. How much longer? Oh, it'll take forever. Oh, come on, Soviets, help me. Ah, oh, that manpower, though. Marines! Yeah, so some little marine dudes. You have to train some of these. To go here, over the straits. So that was the marines. Mm, artillery would be nice. Production efficiency cap is really good. But we need to construct more factories. And he will soon have a war goal on me, stupid Brits. <laughs> yeah, we question the sovereignty. Because that's what we do, right? Oh, we have more factories going now. Nice. How much are we using? How much are we stockpiled? 800. We're coupling in Spain 1. Let's go down here. Oh, wow. And yeah, that's good. Hindenburg exploded. I'm afraid of Great Britain. Infrastructure effort. Sure, nice. And it's only 140 days, so let's not go for the armament stuff. Marco Polo Bridge incident, like always. It's between uh, Japan and Soviet, I think. I feel ballsy today. Let's attack. I mean, I could help against Finland. But the Brits will surely just end this campaign. Benelux intervention. The Chamberlain is an asshole in this playthrough. What is Hitler up to? In the army invention. It's not show Hitler too long because the internet will just explode if I do that. The research time. It's really nice. Um, the doctrine would be really nice as well. Everything would be nice. A more soft attack. A plain bonus. Yes, let's go for that. <laughs> this guy. Hey Sven, how are you? How long? Ah, uh, yeah, end of this year. Fine. I could just go and edit these things with another artillery. Ah, let's do that. Concentrated industry, more stuff, more production of everything. I modify the government. We need uh, soon attack and defense, and we get. Let's get Axel here. It's artillery. And then we might as well just get a artillery bonus. Yeah, this is another thing to construct, though. Uh, yeah, I want to go here. Spare the bonus for later. <coughs> also, Portuguese is just knocking at my door via Facebook. I have to record my Crusader Kings campaign now, I guess. Uh, Selling calls to aid Norwegian workers. We will crush that bourgeois dictatorship, indeed. And I'll leave you with that. I see you guys next time, hopefully, when either 
we crush Norway or Great Britain crushes us. I don't know. Anyway, see you guys next time. And of course, I love you all. Subscribe and everything. Bye.